and then they fucking get out of their cars with baseball bats and start running at me and I'm just like Hey guys, what's up? It's Ben back again with another video uh, Today I'm gonna be skating into the CBD of Auckland The reason I'm going in is because I want to get some footage of a really empty city for a film that I'm working on and yeah, I'm just kind of sick of being inside the house. I've been going for runs and walks and shit, getting out, working out, but um, yeah, I've just been going a bit crazy. <laughs> you know, I'm usually out of the house 12, 14 hours a day, so it's been really weird being stuck inside. And you know, I'm by myself. I'm not fucking talking to anyone, so it's all good. I'm hoping that the city is as empty as people have been saying it is. Um, some of my friends work in the CBD and they said it's like really empty but I'm skeptical because around here there's still so many people walking the streets and shit um, you know everyone's technically meant to be inside and shit and so many people outside way more than normal but anyway skating there now it's like an hour away so let's go Taking a break, I'm about two thirds, three quarters of the way to the CBD. Um, but skating is a lot more <laughs> intensive than I thought it would be. I kind of wish I had a bike actually. Um, but I thought I'd just chill out for a bit and tell you guys the story of this time that um, me and my mate got fucking chased by these three cars. Um, I teased it last vlog and I've told quite a few people about it and I think it's a pretty good story. So, yeah, um, this is two, three years ago. Uh, me and my mate, we were just out for a cruise and my, this is my first car when I had a Subaru B4. Uh, it's a 3 litre H6 engine. Um, really fun car. It was, a, it was a Sunday at like 11pm or midnight. And I think we just drove to the McDonald's to get a drink or something. And we were just cruising around, you know, not even speeding or anything, just fucking driving, you know, just chilling. And we drive past this gas station and then there's three cars in the gas station just fucking screaming at each other, like just going ballistic. And we like, what the fuck? So we do a U-turn up the road and we drive back and we drive past them really slow. And they just look at us and they're like, you want to, like, what the fuck are you looking at? Get the fuck out of here. And we're just like, fuck. All right, sorry about it. And so we boost off. Next thing we know, we look in the rear view and there's three cars just flying at us from behind. So I'm like, holy fuck, foot to the floor. Like, this guy was about to hit the back of our car if we didn't, put, like, if I didn't put my foot to the floor. We're going down this hill. This is like top of the North Shore, like Albany area as well. So I'm going down this road and there's a huge speed bump at the bottom of the road. So I'm like, holy fuck, I need to slam on my brakes. Otherwise, I'm going to jump over the speed bump and my suspension is just going to shatter. And so there I slow down, go over the speed bump slowly. One of them comes past me, flies over the speed bump, just fucking all the way over it, slams onto his suspension, goes in front of me. Another one comes to the side of me um, and then another one behind me and they like block me in. So I'm like in the middle. There's one in front, one to the side. Flip up the other side and one behind me. And um, and then they fucking get out of their cars with baseball bats and start running at me. And I'm just like, okay, this just got fucking next level serious. Um, oh, and one of them fucking hits the back of my car as I'm slowing down. So I'm like, fuck, this just got real serious real quick. So I'm like, to my friend, I'm like, get on the phone with the fucking cops right now. Um, and he calls the cops. And as, as this guy's running at me from the front of the baseball bat, I just fucking swerve, go up onto the footpath. Luckily it was like four wheel drive and it was really high. So I just like yeeted it onto the fucking footpath. Went around him and we're just flying. I think I was going like, you know, and I told the cops this, they didn't give a fuck because I was getting chased. And um, I think I was going like 180, 190 in, this, in these suburban streets, you know, 50 k's an hour, like really topping out this fucking Subi <laughs> that I was driving. And um, like just going, you know those roundabouts that have the curves just flying over those at like 200 k's an hour. It was real scary actually, it was, real, it was the only time in my life where I thought that I might actually die. Because um, these guys, I could tell they were just either mentally ill or just cracked out of their fucking minds. Eventually we lose them 
like we probably got chased for like 10k we went down most of the shore through the side streets finally got onto the motorway ended up being able to lose them and i'm really happy that i had that car and not my next car which i got a few months later which is my mx5 because i would have been fucking dead like they were screaming shit like fucking kill them like you know baseball bats knives um it was some spooky shit um but yeah got onto the bridge drove straight to the police station told them nothing ever came of it obviously um we got the security footage from the gas station and they said that the camera angle didn't see them or fucking i don't know yeah they're pretty useless of that stuff but um yeah that's the story of how i almost died so yeah all right let's get a little break let's get back into the into the skating <laughs> Cool, so my vlog camera ended up dying last night, um, but I got the footage that I wanted. As you saw, I did like a quick color correction on those clips, and I just wanted like a, I just wanted like a sort of creepy, eerie, empty city vibe. Um, so that's being used for probably like the next car video I do. I'm not actually sure what, what I'm gonna use it for yet, but I thought it'd be a good opportunity, and I was just bored, so. Yeah, I uh, got that done and it's now the next day, um, the sun's just setting, I've been working this morning, made a mean fucking pie, and yeah, now I'm just gonna um, chuck my car into the driveway, the golf, and give it a quick clean because I have not cleaned it in a long time, and in two months and three weeks, when I hop inside, I want it to be nice and nice and uh, clean, so yeah, I'll let us uh, chuck a GoPro on my head and show you guys that. So, got the car into the driveway, uh, got my pressure washer there set up. So we're gonna snow foam the whole car, um, rinse that off, and then get our uh, wash mitt with some soap. I'm using some United Car Care products. And then rinse that off. Oh, do the wheels first. We're gonna spray the wheels with some uh, wheel, wheel cleaner and give those a brush. Make sure those are all good because they're fucking disgusting. So let's get into it.
all done now. Uh, looks way better. And even though I can't try it for another two months and three weeks, um, it's nice and clean. I mean, it'll probably rain and I'll have to give it a quick once over uh, before I take it out. And I also have to do a complete interior. But I think I'm going to be getting a wet vac soon, which is those like wet vacuums that shampoo. I'm going to do the interior, or well, the carpets in here, and the full interior in the Z. And I'll probably do another interior video um, of both cars because both the interiors are pretty average. So yeah, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Uh, if you're not already subscribed, subscribe down below, and I will see you in a few days, the next one. Later.